selecting multiple layers. Many times we want to select multiple layers at one time when we are deleting things or changing the properties of the layer. Say we're going to change multiple uh, layer properties like the color. And since you can't do them individually, sometimes I've seen like 1,500 layers in a drawing. Uh, you know, you just can't go through and pick them all individually. So we want to go along and let's say I pick the center line so it's highlighted. Now, if I hold the shift key, it picks any layers in between there. Now, if I want to hold the control key, I can pick any individual layers I like. All right. And so I'm holding the, the control key to select those layers. I can also right click and I can say select all and it'll select every layer in the list and I can right click and say clear all so I can now I'll go along here and one typical thing is I'll come along here and say oh I want to hit the shift key and pick all those particular layers and then I'll hold the control key and pick down the last two layers in the list if I right click I can say invert the selection and when I invert the selection everything flip-flops and it selects just the section layer because that one was not selected and in this case the current layer is the layer that's got the green check mark so when I right click I can select all but the current layer so I'm selecting everything but that layer at this time so that's another method and so we can select multiple layers at one time typically the layers will be sorted by its name and then we could use things like shift uh, to, con to select continue uh, several consecutive layers we can hold down the shift key for several non consecutive layers and we can right click and use any one of these four selections uh, select all clear all select all but the current layer and the current layer is the one with the green check mark and we can invert the selection flip it upside down if you will